dear students now we are discussing some additional problems from the area calculation of fund from operation okay the problems related to fund from operation will be just like this let us go through the problem calculate fund from operation from following information relating to a company for the year 31st December 2015 then we are given with a lot of details net profit depreciation loss on sale profit on sale etc what are the features of these items depreciation loss on sale profit on sale provision for tax etc these are non fund non operating items so here we are we have to use indirect method most of the problems given in our examination will be using indirect method okay how to start with our problem firstly we have to start with our profit write down net profit then write add non fund non operating expenses debited what are the non fund non operating expenses depreciation is an example loss on sale of machinery is an example it is to be added profit on sale of investment it is also a non operating item but it is a profit so it is to be deducted then provision for tax during the year it is a non fund non operating item goodwill return off it is another item preliminary expenses return off it is another item then dividend received dividend is not paid it is received so it is an income it is to be deducted it is a non fund non operating income okay then another one is to be noted always is interim dividend interim dividend what is interim dividend it is the dividend paid between the financial year ee varshathin edakku koduthada so this amount should not be added back i know this we know interim dividend is a non fund item it is a non operating item it is a fund item but non operating item but here it is not to be added because interim dividend it is already adjusted it will be included in our profit for the year for example the profit for the year is 150000 this 150000 will include will be including this interim dividend paid adondu thanne idu nammal veendum randamathu add cheyanda avashyam illa ee interim dividend adakkamulla amount aanu 150000 are you clear so it is to be ignored then another advertisement expenses paid what is the peculiarity of advertisement expenses it is a cash item it is an operating item so this also to be ignored okay so we have gone through the cases then we let us examine how to solve the problem okay net profit for the year is shown here add non fund non operating expenses and losses example depreciation loss on sale provision for tax we have already mentioned it goodwill return off preliminary expenses return off etc we will add all these items and write the total here then we will add both the items then less non fund non operating incomes profit on sale dividend received okay both are to be added shown here then it is to be deducted from 293000 the balance 278000 is considered as fund from operation are you clear let us go through another example we have given a profit or loss account another model of question is like this profit or loss account for a particular year is given and asked with calculation of fund from operation okay when we go through these items what are the peculiarity of these items on the credit side there is gross profit if we are using direct method we can start with that then interest is non fund non operating income profit on sale is non fund non operating income refund of income tax is non fund non operating item if there are such type of non fund non operating items it is better to start firstly with indirect method so we will start with this item 120000 that is we will start with net profit okay then we will add non fund non operating expenses debited what are the non fund non operating expenses debited salary rent lighting audit fee depreciation 
depreciation is a non fund non operating item preliminary expenses written off it is a non fund non operating item loss on sale is a non fund non operating item selling expenses is an operating item then provision for tax is a non fund non operating item we will show net profit and we will add these items then we will deduct interest on investment profit on sale of investment or low uh, refund of income tax these are non fund non operating incomes these are to be deducted the balance will be fund from operation otherwise we can start with the direct method that is start with gross profit then from the gross profit we will deduct cash operating item salary rent lighting audit then next selling expense these are to be deducted the balance will be fund from operation okay here is the solution here we have used indirect method we have started with net profit for the year okay then we have added non fund non operating expenses depreciation primary expense loss on sale of investment provision for tax okay both are added then next less non fund non operating incomes interest profit refund okay both are shown here then it is deducted from the total the balance 178000 is considered as fund from operation sorry it is considered as fund from operation okay are you clear i think you are clear then i have given you one more model this is the third model of giving questions the following are the balances extracted from the balance sheet as on 31st december 2014 and 15 you are required to calculate fund from operation and the period will la details there okay firstly in the kind of the goodwill goodwill in the same way goodwill has reduced that means goodwill is written off preliminary expense 20 in 15 i churing in our turn down it is written off then general reserve 40 in 50 i marry and are them transfer to general reserve profit or loss account balance in the third kind of guy profit or loss account balancing in a random or shut the details there are angle first year it is 1 lakh 20 second year it is 2 lakh what is the meaning of that first year in 2014 it is 1 lakh 20 balance of profit or loss account is 1 lakh 20 in the second year 2015 the balance of profit or loss account is 2 lakh what is the meaning of that what is the current year profit current year profit is not 2 lakh current year profit is 80000 karanam da already 1 lakh 20000 undu ee golla adu 2 lakh aayittu increase cheyidu en artham endana balance 2 lakh aayi koodi nanu alla adu current year profit 2 lakh alla current year profit is 2 lakh minus 1 lakh 20 80000 is current year profit are you clear then next item is provision for depreciation provision 30 42 what is the meaning new provision provision for the depreciation during the year is 12000 proposed dividend this is another item to be shown proposed dividend 2014 2015 is given here we have to notice that we will assume that the theory will last year proposed dividend previous year proposed dividend ഈ വർഷം കൊടുത്തു എന്നാണ് ട്രീറ്റ് ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് പെയ്ഡ് എന്ന രീതിയിലാണ് ട്രീറ്റ് ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് അപ്പം അതുകൊണ്ട് തന്നെ ഇപ്പോൾ ഫോർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ ഫസ്റ്റ് ഇയർ ട്വൻറ്റി ഫൈവ് തൗസൻഡ് പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് സെക്കൻഡ് ഇയർ പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് തേർട്ടി തൗസൻഡ് അതിൻ്റെ അർത്ഥം ഈ വർഷം പ്രപ്പോസ് ചെയ്ത എമൗണ്ട് ആണ് തേർട്ടി തൗസൻഡ് കഴിഞ്ഞ വർഷത്തെ ട്വൻറ്റി ഫൈവ് തൗസൻഡ് കൊടുത്തിട്ടുണ്ടായിരിക്കാം അങ്ങനെയാണ് നമ്മൾ അസ്യൂം ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് ഇപ്പോൾ ട്വൻറ്റി ഫൈവ് തൗസൻഡ് പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് പെയ്ഡ് ആയിട്ടേ ട്രീറ്റ് ചെയ്യാവൂ തേർട്ടി തൗസൻഡ് എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് ഈ വർഷത്തെ പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻ്റ് ആണ് അതല്ലാതെ മറ്റ് ഐറ്റംസിൽ നമ്മൾ ചെയ്ത പോലെ തേർട്ടി മൈനസ് ട്വൻറ്റി ഫൈവ് ഫൈവ് തൗസൻഡ് എന്ന് എഴുതരുത് ഇൻ കേസ് ഓഫ് പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് ദ അസംഷൻ ഇസ് ദാറ്റ് ലാസ്റ്റ് ഇയർ പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് വിൽ ബി പെയ്ഡ് കറണ്ട് ഇൻ ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദ ഇയർ സോ ദ പ്രപ്പോസ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദ ഇയർ പ്രപ്പോസ് ഡിവിഡൻഡ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദ ഇയർ വിൽ ബി ദ ന്യൂ പ്രപ്പോസൽ ഡിവിഡൻഡ് ഫോർ ദ ഇയർ ഓക്കെ ദൻ ലെറ്റസ് ഗോ ത്രൂ ദ പ്രോബ്ലം നെറ്റ് പ്രോഫിറ്റ് ഫോർ ദ ഇയർ net profit for the year is not 2 lakh but it is 2 lakh minus 1 lakh 20 that is 80000 the next add non fund non operating expenses debited what are the non fund items goodwill return off preliminary expenses return off transfer to reserve 
provision for depreciation proposed dividend 2015 that's 30 minus 25 30 last year and current year and amount of money okay this is add the next less than the non-fund non operating income so fund from operation is 147,000 fund from operation is 147,000 I am giving you one more question. Calculate fund from operation from the following profit or loss appropriation account. Gross profit, profit on sale of building. Okay. On the rubbish side, salary, rent, depreciation, printing and stationery, primary expenses return off, goodwill return off, provision for tax, proposed dividend, net profit taken to balance sheets. Okay. Then how to solve this problem? How to solve this? We can use direct method or indirect method. Direct method you say anangil, simply start with the gross profit. Okay, start with the gross profit. Then idil nindum, cash operating expenses will see a salary or end depreciation cash operating alla, non cash non operating item. Aana. Okay. Printing and stationary expense. Okay. Primary expense return off. Goodwill return off, provision for tax, proposed dividend. Can you? But three lu, one lakh in the e moon item less either in all fund from operation cut. That is direct method. Then indirect method. And the end of the first in case of indirect method, we will start with net profit for the year. Then add non fund non operating expenses, depreciation. Then primary expenses return off, goodwill return off. Provision for tax, proposed dividend. All these are non-fund, non-operating expense. These are added. Then less non-profit, non-operating income. That is profit on sale of building. 10,000. Balance will be fund for operation. So you write down all these questions in your notebook. And you solve this particular problem, the last problem. And send into my WhatsApp personal number. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much.